Welcome. This tutorial will introduce you to a powerful yet often overlooked feature within the Zojo IDE. Specifically, I'm referring to the contextual help feature, which makes finding information about the elements you're using incredibly easy. You can access this feature from anywhere in the IDE. For example, in the layout editor, simply right-click the object you need help with and then click the Help For menu item. After clicking the Help For Desktop Window menu option, Zojo will open the Help Manual directly to the page for the desktop window object. Let's see the Help Manual for a button. Select the button, open the contextual menu, and click the Help For Desktop button object. As you can see, the Help page opens, providing detailed information about the specific type of object you selected. Let's do this step one more time, this time for the desktop list box object. By the way, you can also click the help icon from the main toolbar. Okay, okay, but what about when you are writing code? Does the contextual help feature work in the code editor? Well, let's check it out. Let's say you want to learn more about the select folder dialog class. What features does it offer? Let's use the contextual help to explore that. See, it works great. The contextual help feature is there for just about everything in Zojo, from the basic keywords to classes, functions, and the list goes on, and it even understands dot notation. So if you need help with a specific property or function, you'll get the info you need right away, saving you time. Well, that's it for this tutorial. I hope you've learned something interesting about how the Zojo IDE makes development easier. Now go have fun creating amazing apps.